A new preprint study found that the genes that determine sex in cannabis plants are located on the X chromosome. But wait, does that mean that qPCR tests that target the Y chromosome, like our FEM indicator, are poor predictors of plant sex? Well, no. In fact, cannabis plants that have a Y chromosome will still develop as male. And here's why. Our story starts with a molecule called ethylene. Ethylene is a hormone that has feminizing effects on many plant species. Simply put, plants that have high levels of ethylene will develop female flowers. Conversely, plants that have very low levels of ethylene will default to male characteristics. Now what this new preprint found was the ACS gene, which controls ethylene production in cannabis plants. That gene happens to be on the X chromosome. So plants that have two copies of an X chromosome will produce high levels of ethylene, therefore they're female. Conversely, plants that only have one copy of the X chromosome will produce low levels of ethylene. Therefore, they'll develop male characteristics. So, as you can see, there is still value in looking for the Y chromosome if you're looking to identify males early. Another interesting thing is that the ACS gene may be the hermaphrodism gene that breeders have been looking for. More on that in our next video.